Hey guys, welcome back to Loop Hub. Today we'll talk about the most disgusting Dr. Pitmo Popper moments that made us shudder. Let's head into it. Number 1. One patient, 14 lipomas. Dr. Sandra Lee rang into the new year with a bang. 12 to be exact. 12 Pops of Christmas, a holiday special from the California Dermatologist, aired on TLC on Thursday night. Lee's initial TLC series ended its first season about 5 months before the special aired. The show has already been cleared for a new season, which will premiere in January of next year. Lee was followed as she treated 12 patients with a range of skin disorders orders, from cysts to a 55-year-old blackhead in this program. Gene Marcus, a guy with an uncommon illness that causes several fatty lumps called lipomas to develop under the skin, was one of the special's famous patients. During the show, Gene Marcus, who was only named by his first name, stated that he had many lipomas on his arms and chest since the first one appeared in middle school. A lipoma is a benign, slow-growing fatty lump located just beneath the skin, and the reasons are unknown. This is starting to influence my regular existence, Gene Marcus stated during an interview segment exposing the visible pimp on his forearms. They make me feel self-conscious. Gene Marcus revealed to Lee that his father and sister have several lipomas as well. Lee was diagnosed with familial multiple lipomatosis. As a result of this family connection, it's an inherited disorder that can be seen in numerous generations of family members, Lee explained. It's harmless and typically painless, but it's an eyesore. FML occurs in families, although the underlying genetic etiology is yet unknown. Lipomas usually appear on the arms, legs, and chest with this illness. Even if they are painless, multiple or very large lipomas can have a detrimental influence on one's quality of life, and surgical removal of the lumps is occasionally required. Following an inspection, Lee decided to remove 14 lipomas from Gene Marcus's forearms and chest. Lipomas aren't a new problem for Lee. They've been in several of her YouTube videos, and even in the first season of her TLC show. Lee has already removed numerous huge lipomas, some of which were the size of bowling balls. Gene Marcus, on the other hand, followed a different procedure. During a fast-paced montage sequence complete with holiday music and subtle squelching sound effects, Lee pulled out a total of 14 microscopic lipomas from beneath Gene Marcus's skin. Each one came out in a single, tiny, pleasing piece. Gene Marcus's forearms were noticeably smoother in shape after the lipomas were removed, and his skin was sewn together. In the special, he added, I absolutely feel like a new guy. I'll have brand new arms and a new chest, and I'll be able to wear t-shirts once more. I believe this was the nicest Christmas present I could have given myself. Below is an action-packed promo for the special, which includes a footage of a lipoma popping out. The TLC Go app will also have 12 pops of Christmas on the Man, as well as past episodes of Dr. Pimple Popper series, which can be found on the app and on the TLC website. Number 2. Nose Growth Fans of Pimples, rejoice! Season 3 of TLC's Dr. Pimple Popper has released its trailer, which contains plenty of cysts, scales, and growths. Dr. Sandra Lee will treat a variety of patients, including a man with nose growths so large they prevent him from breathing, a teen with a brown rash that caused him to be teased at school, and a woman with ear cysts that give her terrible headaches, as shown in the teaser video. Dr. Lee had treated similar frightening instances in the previous seasons, including a lady with fluid-filled cysts around her eyes, another woman with a painful horn growing in the back of her skull, and a woman with a painful horn growing in the back of her head. Number 3. MacGyver Cyst Punch The third season of Dr. Sandra Lee's show hasn't aired yet, but she's provided plenty of delicious pimple popping stuff in the meantime. Lee posted a YouTube video on Wednesday in which she treated the man's back cyst with the technique she dubbed the MacGyver Cyst Punch. Lee demonstrated the procedure and compared it to coring an apple in the video. She applied pressure to a device she called a punch and placed it on the top of the cyst, creating a 4mm deep hole in the cyst. Lee then removed the punch device and, with a few targeted squeezes, was able to drain fluid from the cyst. According to Lee, this is one of the more hard cysts to treat. This brings us to the end of our video. I hope you enjoyed it. Hit like if you did, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel so that you don't miss any of our videos in the future. Also, watch the two videos that are on your screen because I'm sure you'll love them. With that, I'll see you in the next video.